Hello everyone and for today I have this hot blue pack for Windows 10 from version 1903 all the way up to the 20H2. First I want to show you my version of the Windows. In start menu I will type about and I will choose about your PC. So you can see my version of the Windows is 20H2. Here in this pack we have custom theme, we have custom icon pack and custom MUI side images. We have fonts and we have a lot of the extra. Here we have aim skin, blue hot dog icons. These are rocket dog skins. We have custom star buttons and we have Vinrar theme. First I will show you how to download this theme. So this is custom theme for Windows 10 1903 but you just saw that my version is 20H2 so don't worry this theme is working from this build all the way up to the 20H2. Before you download this custom theme you need to make account on virtual customs. Here is the download link to download this theme. When you download this theme you have installation tutorial and readme. Here you have text document how to install this custom team and before you install or apply any custom team you need to patch your windows 10 and how to do that how to install ultra ux team patcher start is back all the new explorer you can watch my tutorial how to do that after you install ultra ux team patcher all new explorer start is back you will be able to apply any custom team I will go here in the team folder, copy this, go to local disk C, Windows, go to the resources, teams, paste it here. Here is the custom team. Now I will go to the start is back properties, here in appearance I will select this custom start menu. Now I will change the custom start button, which I already did. Here is the custom start button, click apply. Now to change the custom start button, go to this green little plus. Go to the extras, orbs and choose one of these start buttons. Select it, click open, select it here and click OK. You are done. Now go back and go to the fonts folder here. I will select these fonts and I will click install but I have already do that so I will just click yes here only to show you how to install these fonts. Right click install I will just replace the installed fonts on my PC. Now go back and here we have HUD machine icon pack. Here we have MUI side images and HUD machine blue icon pack. Here we have 70SP application. I will run this as administrator. I will go to the add a custom pack. I will go to the hot blue pack, hot machine icon pack and here select the hot machine blue icon pack. Click open. Here is the preview of this custom icon pack. Now go to the extra, go to the options, choose this create new restore point, click on save. Now first I will install this custom icon pack and then I will install MUI side images. Here I will click on start patching, click yes. So now after the patching is done you need to restart your PC so do not click no here click yes and I will click yes I will stop the recording and I will be back after restarting. Okay now after restarting you should get this message as me the system has been patched. You can click ok here and you can check the new custom icon pack on the windows. Okay, now let's go to install the MUI side images. So again, go to the HUD machine icon pack and run the 7TSP as administrator. Here, select one more time, add a custom pack. 
Now choose the MUI side images, click open, click yes. Here just click start patching. Click yes one more time. Ok that was quick, now one more time you need to restart your PC and here do not click no so click yes one more time and one more time after restarting my PC I will be back. Ok after restarting my PC I am getting the same message the system has been patched click ok here. Now go to the control panel here set the large icons and if I open file explorer options you can see the MUI side images. Ok we are done with custom icon pack and custom MUI side images. Here I will apply the desktop background. So I will set this on my desktop background. Now go to the extras and here we have some of the icons and the skins. First I will install AIMP skin. So if you have AIMP like me, open up the AIMP and here go to the skins. Now go to the install and then go to the hot blue pack. Select the AIMP skin and click open. Now if I select this and click apply you can change the color whatever you like. But I will select this blue color click apply click OK. So this is the AIMP skin. Ok now in the extras folder we have blue hot dock icons. You have a lot of the icons and here you have a dock hot icon. This is PSD format. I will open this in the Photoshop. So here in the Photoshop if you want to create your custom icon for your personal use you can easily change the text and to create a icon you need to find the image on the internet and edit it in the Photoshop so which I did for my icons on the dock. So I will leave this PSD file so you can edit your custom icon and when you save, save this format in PNG and you are done. So after you do that you can copy this somewhere on your PC some location that will not be visible so I have this uh, folder icons and here I have blue hot dock icons and now if you have a rocket dock like me you can select an icon so go to the icon settings here you have folders and then just click on this plus then go to the your location so let's see icons blue hot dock icons click OK from the folder you choose your desired icon. So you choose the icon and click OK and you are done. Ok go back to the extras we have rocket dock skin you have many of them but for this tutorial I am using this I think so. Yes it is. So choose this is for top and this is for bottom because my rocket dock is on bottom so I will copy this folder local disk C program files here is the rocket dock go to the skins and just paste it here and after that go to the dock settings go to the style and here in the team option select HUD EVO version 2 click OK OK the last step in the extra folder is winner team so I will just open this click yes to install it. If I type WinRAR, if I go to the options, go to the teams and from here I can select I can select HUD evolution and there you go the team has been selected. And now each archive that is in WinRAR zip file will be like this icon and that is really great. Okay we are done with this HUD blue pack for Windows 10 
So this is like completely customization of the windows with custom icon pack that I have prepared for you. Ok now if you have a one question how to restore everything to Windows 10 default it's very simply I'm not gonna restore everything because I'm gonna use this for a while. So if we want to restore a team simply go to the personalize go to the teams. And from here just select the Windows 10 default team. And then go to the start is back properties and choose the default visual style of start start menu. Now if you want to restore the custom icon pack and custom MUI side images, you need to run this 70SP one more time as administrator of course. And now just choose this option restore, and then choose first option restore modified file restore modified system files to before 70SP was used. Click OK and after restoring uh, 70SP will ask you to restart your PC and of course you click yes to restart. After restarting you should get the default Windows 10 icons and Windows 10 MUI side images. And that's it. If you have some questions leave a comment and I will try to help you and respond to you. Now I will just do a quick preview of this custom team and the custom icon pack, so enjoy the rest of the video.